Tenardin can be used via My Courses as a learning tool for improved writing. The program flags similarity and mechanical errors in written work via originality and grade mark reports. If you choose to enable this service, please make sure to go to the step-by-step -step tutorial and place the statement um, in your syllabus about Turnitin. To enable it on a, this particular tutorial shows you how to enable Turnitin on an existing Dropbox. Click Submission Review on the nav bar, click Dropboxes. Click on the context menu next to the name of the Dropbox. Click Edit Folder. Under, within the Originality check area, click the checkbox next to Enable this folder. You should note that once this is enabled for the Dropbox, it cannot be disabled. And also note that when the course is copied, this checkbox is unchecked and the feature must be re-enabled for the Dropbox each term. After you have that check, scroll down to the bottom and in the area that says show high advanced originality checking options make sure that that's opened so that you can see all of the different originality options the first one allow submitters to see originality reports that should be checked this al chooses allows your students to see their own originality report which is the whole purpose of turn it in is to uh, have it as a teaching experience frequency um, I would leave this alone, but allow automatic originality checking on all submissions. This means all submissions to the Dropbox will be checked automatically. Identify individual students for originality checking. What that means is that you physically have to click on each one of the submissions to push it into the Turnitin uh, database. Check submissions against. Leave these all checked. User paper database. This checks the plagiarism using previous submissions to the Turnitin database current and archived internet. This searches the internet for matching content and periodicals, journal, and publications. Searches periodicals, journals, and publications for content similar to the submission. Index file for originality checking. Um, if this is checked, which it should be, allows paper to be used in the paper database for future comparison. Now, the grammar and check uh, settings. If you have this checked, you can then choose which, how advanced you want the grammar to be. You can then also choose the categories enabled um, for the grammar. So if you don't want to check spelling, you don't want to check usage or mechanics, you can uncheck these. You can also look in specific dictionaries. So you have all those choices. When you're all done, click Save and Close. When, you'll be, when you're done, you'll be taken back to the Dropbox folder list, and next to the name of the Dropbox you just enabled, turn it in, will be a little icon telling you that originality check is enabled.